Welcome to the 2012 Jim Nance Award in STAA All-America Announcement Program. I'm John Chalesnik, CEO of Sportscasters Talent Agency of America. Quick heads up before we get underway. We are streaming this via Ustream. And as you may or may not already be aware, Ustream randomly drops ads into the middle of live stream broadcasts. So if one happens to be dropped in the middle of this broadcast over information that you didn't want to miss, don't worry about it because within minutes of the completion of this live stream, we're going to post the entire top 20 and STAA All-America honorable mentions on the All-America page of the STAA website. I want to thank everybody who applied for the All-America program this year. I tell you what, the quality of all of the applicants that we received this year, including those that fell short of honorable mention, far and away better than anything I ever did uh, when I graduated from Kansas State more than 20 years ago. So you guys are well ahead of the game this year, and you're to be applauded for that most certainly. I also want to thank our judges this year, Tom Bowman from Learfield Sports, Chad Cleveland of IMG, Wes Durham of the Atlanta Falcons and Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets, one of the legends in sports talk radio, one of my mentors, Lee Hacksaw Hamilton of X Sports Radio in San Diego, also a longtime NFL play-by-play -play voice. Paul Keels, the voice at Ohio State, is on our judging panel again this year, as is Bill Roth from Virginia Tech. And joining our panel for the first time this year, Jerry Schimmel, one of the truly great guys in the business, the play-by-play -play voice of the Colorado Rockies. While we are announcing the All-Americans and the Jim Nance Award winner right now, the presentation of the Jim Nance Trophy will be part of the National Sportscasters and Sportswriters Association's annual banquet June 11th in Salisbury, North Carolina. One other note before we get underway. Graduations coming up for the class of 2012. Give yourself the gift of STAA. Let us help you with your career. You know, so many times, uh, you know, typical graduation gifts are uh, television, a trip to Europe, <laughs> you know, a blender. I don't know. I don't know what people give for graduation these days. But invest in your career and invest in yourself. We'll help you uh, with the job market and we'll help you get your demo and resume in front of employers. We'll provide you with job leads. Uh, many of them will be exclusive to STAA clients. And you'll also receive unlimited career planning and consulting among the variety of resources that we provide. We have what we're calling a 3-2-1 special for all college students, including members of the class of 2012. If you join STAA, through the STAA website before midnight tomorrow night, Saturday, May 5th, we'll give you three free months of STAA services. If you join by midnight Sunday night, we'll give you two free months of STAA services. And if you join STAA again via our website by midnight Eastern time Monday, we'll still give you a free month of STAA services. Now, Let's get on to the rankings. We'll begin with honorable mentions, and we'll mention them in alphabetical order by last name. First of all, a senior from the University of Indiana, Scott Agnes. A sophomore from John Carroll University, Dale Armbruster. From the University of North Texas, senior Tyler Bolden. A junior from Hofstra University, Kevin Dexter. Another junior from Kansas University, Alex Gold. A junior from Virginia Commonwealth, Tommy Lopez. From Hood College in Maryland, senior Doug Raftery. And another senior from Penn State University, Dave Walkovic. So congratulations to all of our honorable mention honorees. Now to the top 20. The 20th ranked sportscaster, collegiate sportscaster across the country, this year, a senior from Syracuse, Eric Silverman. Number 19, 
a senior from Wisconsin, Kyle Deckelbaum. At number 18, a senior from Butler University, Mark Minner. Checking in at number 17, Kansas University grad student, Kyle West. At number 16, representing, imagine that, Syracuse, tremendous program there in upstate New York, Andrew Cannell. The 15th ranked collegiate sportscaster of 2012, a senior from Emerson College, and the first female to ever be among our nationally ranked students, Samantha Russo. Congratulations, Samantha. Number 14, a senior from Boston University, David Lombardi. At number 13, the second representative from John Carroll University, a junior, Brendan Gulick. The 12th ranked sports broadcaster is another senior from Emerson College in Boston and another female with a very bright future, Lily Zhao. Checking in at number 11, a junior from DePaul University, Ryan Foudy. Now to the top 10. At number 10, a junior from Ball State University, Pat Boylan. At number 9, a senior from St. Cloud State, Zach Fish. The 8th ranked sportscaster in the country this year is from Elon, a junior, Greg Broskowski. At number 7, a junior from Gonzaga, Greg Talbot. Now to the 2012 STAA All-America class. Checking in at number six, a senior from Syracuse, Craig Hoffman. At number five, another Syracuse student, junior Chris Lewis. The fourth ranked sports broadcaster in the country this year and a member of the class of All-Americans of 2012, a senior and the third representative from Emerson College, Ben Barker. Special accommodation to to one of the instructors there at Emerson, John Rook, is doing a fabulous job. This isn't the first time I've noticed his students and that they've set themselves apart in the competition, but it is the best represented that Emerson College has been in the top 20. Keep up the good work, John. At number three is a senior from Fordham University, Kyle Kessis. The second ranked sportscaster in the country this year, rounding out our group of All-Americans, a junior from Syracuse, John Nolan. And now for the number one spot. For the second straight year, a junior is the winner of the Jim Nance Award. And for the first time, four of the top six students in our All-America rankings are from the same university. The 2012 winner of the Jim Nance Award, a junior from Syracuse University, Bill Spaulding. Bill, congratulations. Congratulations to all of our honorees and to all of our applicants. Again, top-notch group.